Hi, I'm Mike Kubicek, an applications engineer with Worldwide Electric. This is one of a series of videos to help you wire and configure our WDFC World Drive Flex Control Chassis VFD. In this video, we will show you how to wire the WDFC drive for a three-wire start-stop operation. We are going to wire in our start and stop button as well as our three-wire jumper. To start, we're going to run out of our CM common terminal out to our start and stop buttons. There are multiple CM terminals on the terminal strips and they're all internally jumpered so it does not matter which one you land at. This is our common that we're going to take out to our start and stop buttons. We are going to wire our start button into our P1 first input terminal. We're going to wire our stop button into our input 2, our P2 terminal. And then to keep the drive in a three wire setup, we're going to run a jumper from another CM terminal to our P3 input 3 terminal. So the drive is looking for a three wire start stop setup. The drive is now in a three-wire start-stop setup using the CM to P3 for our three-wire input is now closed. When the start button is closed, the drive will run, and when the stop button opens, the drive will stop. That is how you wire in a three-wire application on the WDFC. Once you have all the wires wired in and we're ready to close this up, we can go ahead and put our wires in the channels. Nice and neat. And then you can put your drive cover on and you're good to go. Remember, this video is not a replacement for the product manual and please follow all applicable safety procedures before commencing any work. I hope you found this video helpful. Remember, our website is an excellent source of product documentation and we have other helpful videos on our YouTube channel. We also have applications engineers available to answer questions for your specific application. Lastly, remember, our tech support is available 24-7, 365 days a year. And thank you for being a worldwide customer.